All year long, we're celebrating our diamond anniversary. WFMY News 2 turns 75, and we're highlighting the diamonds in our community. You are nominating people who make a difference. This month's winner is Clement Mallory. He's combined his love of words and basketball to create a program that's helping children of all ages. Kids Poacher Basketball is a literacy program for kids ages 4 to 13 and we teach them how to read, spell, and identify poetry words while playing basketball. Our mission is to develop creative and critical thinking skills through poetry and athletics. It's amazing that God blessed me with this program, this literacy program called Kids Poacher Basketball because I did not learn how to read until I was 17, 18 years old. I had my first kids' poetry basketball session when I was five years old, and ever since then, I've been going to various events. And then, fast forward years later, now I'm working for kids' poetry basketball. Mr. Mallory is kind, Mr. Mallory is a leader, Mr. Mallory is an entrepreneur. He's like really into it, and he loves his community, and I can tell. He's working with kids. He's teaching them basketball, poetry skills, ways to interact with one another, to embrace creativity, you know, physical wellness. And he, he's not gonna toot his own horn. I think he's doing beautiful work for the community and just one of those organizations I don't think people know about. It just doesn't have the visibility. And I'd like more people to know what he's doing. It's so important that our children know that they can and should express themselves. This generation that we're working with right now, it's the next generation to like run this world. These five, six, seven, eight, nine year olds and 30 years from now, wow, they're gonna be running this world. You can see Mr. Mallory and some of his students in action. Kids Poetry Basketball is hosting an event this weekend. It's on Saturday from 2 to 5 at the Windsor Rec Center in Greensboro. It also features music, books, and more all for free. And if you'd like to nominate a community diamond, just go to the Celebrating 75 section of our website, WFMYNews2.com.